Greetings, royal family. I hope y'all are doing great. It's Sunday, you know. And I, for the life of me, can't understand why in the 21st century, men, fuck men, humans think it's okay to get disrespectful when you reject them romantically. Why are we still discussing this? Why am I still having to go through this? So, what happened? Situation, story. Met this dude on the train. You know, he's like, hey, I think I saw him. I thought he was handsome, you know. So, I'm licking, you know. I'm like, okay. And he's like, looking at me. He's like, hey, how you doing today? I'm like, I'm doing good. I'm doing real good, you know. And... Then he's like, um, well, I'm going to get off. This is my stop, but I wanted to get your number. I wanted to make it a point to get to know you, blah, 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 blah. And I'm like, all right. You know, he, he approached it well. He wasn't disrespectful. He seems very well spoken. I am interested, you know. We text him. Not even 15 minutes later, can you call me? I explained to you in our 15 minutes of texting that I am a very busy woman. I work two jobs. I'm trying to run two companies and start two companies of my own. So mama's busy, okay? So texting me is easier because I can't sit on the phone and talk to you all day because I'm busy. But you want me to call you, so I explained this to him again, that I be busy. Well, I just talk to you later since y'all have time to text me. Okay. All right. Well, whatever. Not my nigga. Not my problem. So then I'm carrying on the next day. I wake up. And he texts me good morning. I text him good morning. We texting, you know, when the day started. I'm busy. I can't talk to you on the phone. Text me. So I'm at work. And he texts me. He's like, so you ignoring me? And I'm like, look, this is probably not going to work out between you and me. You should probably lose my number because you don't respect my grind and my time that I dedicate to my grind. And you think that every time it takes me more than five minutes to respond to you that I'm ignoring you. And you're too old for that. You're 32 years old. Why are we having this conversation? But whatever. He's like, okay, bitch. Now, y'all know me. I'm not super like, oh, my God, don't call me a bitch. But, like, I call my friends big all the time. I'm like, big, guess what? Like, but don't disrespect me. Now I'm a bitch and, I, and not a woman or a lady or anything because I'm not interested in you. I'm dedicated to what I'm trying to do right now. So you can't get mad at that and be like, oh, you a bitch now. Like. That's childish. At 32, you still doing that? I dodged a bullet, bro. Like, I really dodged a bullet by telling you to lose my number because what if I started talking to you and then first thing you get mad, that's how you act? I don't got to put up with it. What make you think I was... I ain't... I, for two days... I've been talking to you for not even two days. You hassle me when I don't text you back in five minutes or less. That's stressful. Then, on top of that... And when you get mad and now I'm a bitch, you're going to call me on my name now? Now, and it's different when you're, like, it's the way some people speak. Yeah, that may be the way you speak, but, like, it's the way you use it, too. So, if we done been talking for two days and you never called me a bitch, but now you mad, yeah, I'm offended that you. this is the opportunity that you wanted to use that word. You know what I'm saying? You, I done had niggas who only call me they bitch when they mean, like, my dog. Like, that's my bitch, though. You know what I'm saying? That's my bitch. You know what I'm saying? It's it's a difference. It's a mad big-ass difference. And I just want to make a PSA to all fucking humans. If someone, dis if someone is rejects you romantically and that hurts your feelings, get the fuck over it. Like, yeah. 
it's fucked up that they rejected you, but that's their, they were not interested. That's their choice. You can't disrespect someone because you don't like that they are not interested in you. That is their choice. This is free will. But being disrespectful, now they, they're validated. That's what you're missing too, is now that person is validated and rejecting you because this is how you act. Like you don't have any sense. So this might be slight rantish and slight story time. But I just want to get that off my chest because it's aggravated. And I'm not going to block you because you know that I'm popping. So keep watching, you know. Make sure you're liking, commenting, subscribing to me my and my channel. Um, sorry about my speech today. It's the call. But uh, just don't disrespect people who do reject you. Rejection is a part of life. Be nice about it. Accept it. Don't be a sore loser. That's what you look like. And everyone hates a sore loser. I love you, muchos.